Beardless. All right, what's up, LG family? It is another week. I am too lazy to set up my other camera, so we're gonna just deal with the audio that comes from the GoPro. Apologize, last week, uh, I was gonna post a video. Thank you. Hi, right. <laughs> what's up, LG family? It is another week out on the road. First, let me start off by saying, if this is the first time watching one of my videos, yo, what's up? Welcome. You're officially part of the LG family, so thank you for being here. Hopefully you guys find these videos enjoyful, joy, enjoying, funny, entertaining, informative, whatever. Uh, and if you do, smash that like button. It totally helps. Thank you a bunch. And you're not required to subscribe. It's not a mandate, but I greatly appreciate if you did because it totally helps out the channel. So thanks a bunch. For those of you who return week after week, what's up? Uh, yeah, so last week I was going to post a video introduce you guys to the one and only one uh, <laughs> the one one uh, and my wife ended up having the flu over the weekend so doing my loving husband duties I use that as an excuse to just take care of her and do nothing else um, yeah so she had bronchitis too bronchitis and the flu she was this close to pneumonia um, that was a lot of fun a lot of <laughs> so uh, yeah now you guys are all caught up as I said, this is Juan. This is officially his last week. You want to say hi to everybody? Hi, everybody. <laughs> uh, I know I did a piss poor job of introducing him for the past couple of weeks. Um, he is he was a five weeker. We're in his fourth week, but the guy is a superstar. He's doing phenomenal. So I'm not gonna waste his time. I'm not gonna keep him around for an extra week. It's just not gonna be beneficial. He is already a peacock. Gotta let him spread his wings and fly a cat. So. Uh, yeah, last week, no one's actually gotten to talk to you or hear from you from the LG family, but so far, past three weeks, have been doing stellar. You already know that. I've built your head up like this fucking big. It used to be this big, actually. It's gotten big from all the compliments. You know. Um, <laughs> yeah, so doing solid. And then this week, like I said, uh, that I've told you that I didn't tell on camera, but you know, you're doing everything on your own. And this morning, you did your first deliver on your own. How'd that go? Woohoo! Still sweating right now. <laughs> it was good. Good experience. Good. I'm gonna do it myself. So, uh, what I plan on doing for this week, I'm not really quite sure how much loads of camera we're gonna show, but when we get a moment where it's just, you know, we're, we're taking a break or whatnot, probably like this afternoon or something, um, I'll have a sit down and we'll actually talk to Juan and uh, kind of get to know him, kind of do like a little interview or whatnot, so you guys can kind of meet him and all that good jazz, but, uh, yeah, so we just dropped off the load. We're in St. Joseph, Missouri, by the way. And uh, we're going to head over to the other side of town. We're going to pick up some wire mesh, take that up to Iowa. And uh, we'll catch up with you guys in a little bit. on that shit it's too the, the pieces are too tight this is gonna be a cluster of a, a nightmare we're gonna be putting twists in this bad boy oh yikes Yikey. all right dude i'm gonna aim right in there Totally did not do what I wanted to do. No! Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay. That's the spot that I wanted. Alright. Alright. Can y'all see that? Hopefully the angle's good. See how I did that? That's what we're shooting for. I'm gonna do, so I'm gonna put a twist. I should. 
in theory, stand between there. But let's go take a look on the other side. Is it in the right spot? I don't even know if it's in the right spot. Is that where I threw it? Nope. I knew I came at an angle. There we go. First try. What? Yeah. Number one. One day. <laughs> one day. I grew up to be big and strong just like him. I'm a real boy. Damn it. Do that one at an angle again. Son of a biscuit. It is Tuesday morning and we dropped that rebar off off at a job site. Ugh. Easy easy stuff. And now uh, we are over at the pig pen, dirt pen, whatever pen. You all know what it is. And uh, yeah, so we're doing a drop and then picking up uh, that load over there <laughs> and i'm gonna let him do the entire thing by himself so we'll just uh set the camera up let him do his thing see how he does i'll buy a little old lonesome and we'll be good to go
Judgey Judgerson. Sweet. All right, what's up, everybody? Uh, just real quick, showed you guys Monday and Tuesdays loads. Um, Wednesday was the birthday, so uh, I didn't really do much, and I wasn't gonna record. Uh, went out for a steak dinner, that was phenomenal. And then Thursday wasn't really much, and now we have another Silver Grove load on us, so there's not really much to it. So I wanted to focus the rest of this video, is just quickly to say hi to Juan, introduce him, because you guys didn't get to see him for the past three weeks. And uh, so, what's up? Uh, oh, uh, no, solid, solid last four weeks. Everything's been phenomenal. Absolute superstar. Uh, I have no complaints. I think you'll be a solid driver. Thank but you, thank you. figured, because I know a lot of new drivers, they do watch my videos uh, and they do kind of like to get the, uh, get to know like trainees and kind of some of the stuff you went through. So like, if you don't mind sharing, you know, maybe share, you know, why you got into trucking or what you thought about trucking and then, just kind of like your experiences since you've been with TMC so far is maybe like orientation or what the training was like or maybe like also some of the things you might have been nervous about that are actually weren't that bad or expectations and all that good stuff so well start from the beginning hi my name is Juan de la Torre uh, I started in this company I mean I try to do my CDL because I tried to do it a long time ago it's just like it didn't, I didn't get to the opportunity until now. Mm -hmm. So now that I have it, I mean, I got a recruiter that comes to my school from TMC and I catch my eye on a lot of stuff that he said. A lot of stuff that, that it was, I mean, at the beginning I thought it was a little bit different, but it's, it's, all, it's all there. So with my experience with the TMC, it's been good. I mean, I don't got nothing to say, but I mean, uh, thanks for the opportunity. Uh, I'm gonna try to do my best on them. Uh, the train, the train. Uh, I've been with you for this last four weeks. I, you teach me a lot, a lot that I didn't know. My fear was more like driving a semi truck with the trailer, and with the load. Is it's that's one of my things, you know, downhills, yeah. the curves, you know. Like at the beginning, I was kind of catching and <laughs> eating that line, but I mean, I pick it up. You you teach me well. Besides that, no, I mean, it's, it's, it's been a great experience, great experience. Uh, I think I, I'm still got a lot to learn, a lot to learn, but uh, I think, uh, like you said, you know, I mean, I'm ready to hit the road and and thank you for the last four weeks that I've been here with you. Yeah, well, thank you. Definitely a palate cleanser from Common Core. You know, I don't talk crap behind anybody's back. You know, if I got something to say, I'm gonna say it, Common Core. Um, yeah, no, it was definitely solid. You pick up everything real quick, which just makes my job so much easier that I don't have to repeat myself, which was awesome. So appreciate that. Appreciate the little bit of Spanish you've taught me so far. <laughs> Picking it up as we go, uh, you know, just a little bit. But uh, yeah, uh, you want to give any shout outs to any, you know, family, your wife or anything like that? I was just uh, thank my family, you know, the they with me and this and, and, and appreciate, you know, I appreciated their, their, uh, help. Cause it's, it's, it's a lot of help. You need a lot, a lot of help from the family too. Cause it's not easy to go away for, for a week and come back when you're not used to that. So yeah. yeah thank you to my family. Hell yeah. I'm not that bad. All right. Mrs. Juan's wife. All right. <laughs> no, I know that like some wives, if they watch and they're like, why don't you say anything? You know, it's definitely to cover your butt, so that way she doesn't give a crap. But, uh, and then the last thing too, he got his LG hard hat. Some people have been asking, no, they're not for sale. Sorry, the only way you can get it is you have to train in my truck, which I don't know how much longer that's actually gonna be. Things are playing out. I don't know, keep you guys in the loop. Yeah, see, it's something you learn, keeping you in the loop. Yeah, keep it uh, in the loop. But yeah, he's got the certified sticker on the back, certifying that I have 100% confidence in him. Um, I would have given one of these to Common Core, but Common Core went out and bought his own hard hat, and I wasn't about to spend more money on another hard hat if he just bought one, so I gave him the sticker, so he only got the sticker on his. But uh, yeah, uh, again, appreciate it. It's been an enjoyment for the past four weeks for me as well. And, Thank you, uh, appreciate it. Yeah. So we're gonna cut him loose, because he's got a date with uh, his wife, his, uh, what is it, Sexy Mamacita? Se sexy Mamacita. Sexy Mamacita. Wife. <laughs> uh, 
That's what he said about you, not me. Uh, but yeah, so uh, we'll catch up. Or I'll catch up with you guys next week. Uh, it'll be a short week because of Christmas. And uh, yeah, awesome. Gonna ring. Yeah, finish out the year strong, hopefully. So catch you guys later. Uh, oh, and as always, don't forget to be awesome. All right, later, guys.